morning. Today, I'm going to take a look at a photo editing software that I use. It's called Skyloom Luma 4. Now, the reason I use, I strongly recommend this, uh, this software is because it's so easy to use. I mean, come on, let's be, let's be honest. If I can use it, then anyone can use it because, I mean, I ain't exactly the most savvy bloke when it comes to uh, any kind of editing. So some people say I'm an old fart, but yeah. So if I can use this editing uh, software, then anybody can use it. So on that note, let's start it up so I can show you just how simple it is to use, what you can do with it and everything like that. Now, just before I do, uh, I will say this video is not sponsored by them. It's, they've not asked me to do this video. I'm only doing it because I want to show people what editing software I use. It costs, it only costs 40 pounds to buy. That's not 40 pounds per year. That's 40 pounds outright, uh, which I think is a bargain compared to some of them. You, if you already have stuff like Photo Editor or Photoshop or what, uh, the other ones, you can use this one as an add-on. So it's easy to do there. You can bring your files from there use it in this and then uh, save your files back to uh, Photoshop and stuff like that. But it is an editing software in its own right and it's really, really simple to use. So on that note, let's take a look at it and we'll, I'll talk you through it. When you start it up, you upload your pictures, which I've already done, and then you get it this screen here like this. So. Let's take this first picture here, right? If I wanted to, do, let's have a sky replacement on this picture. So select sky, uh, sunset, and without further ado, it automatically puts in the sunset. Alter how dramatic you wanted the sunset. Whether you, It's all done on sliders, as you can see. And all you do is you just alter it, the horizon position, you can move it up, you can move it down. It's so easy. So that's the picture without the sunset, that's the picture with the sunset. Then you can, everything, like I say, everything is done. If you want to put sun ray, you can have a sun. Click where you want the sun to be. Let's say you want it just there. It'll be a bit weird considering it's night time, but then you can look, you can bring the sun in. So you can actually have night time and sun at the same time. So that's without the sun ray, that's with the sun. But as you can see, you can mess about with it, you can do whatever you want, you know, and then you can go on to the dramatic look, the amount. There's more dramatic. You know, you literally can mess about. Let's take another picture. This one here. Now this one was taken in Cambodia. It looks quite boring. So if you want to put eagle, there's your little eagle just there. See? Uh, you can move where you want that eagle. If you want the eagle to be about there, better up there. You can place the eagle exactly where you want. If you don't want an eagle, you can have clouds, you can have fireworks, replace the fireworks behind there, you can have a giraffe. How about a giraffe? Stick a giraffe behind the back of there. Um, lightning, you can't really see that, but it is there. Of course, look, there you go, you can see it better there. So you can have lightning. Literally, you can play about with this and have anything. If you wanted to have some mountains at the back, how about that? Would that look better with mountains there? A mountain range behind the back of there. Maybe not that mountain range. Maybe you wanted that mountain range. Or that mountain range. It's all done on a click of a button. You can have as much as you want of it. You know, if you want it, you know, if it's if it's too overpowering and you want it sort of blending in so it looks like there, 
like that. You can have it literally wherever you want and for how much you want. Uh, you can have a plane taking off. A rainbow. And you can even load your own custom images. So you could have whatever you want. You can load whatever you want behind there. You can have a, a flock of birds. Another flock of birds. And even another flock of birds. <laughs> You know, literally, there's no end to what you can do. And you can move them so that they're wherever you want them to be. If you wanted them like that, wherever. It's all entirely up to you. Uh, and then, obviously, if I wanted a, a, sky, a blue sky, like that, with a flock of birds behind it. You know, you rather than have the dull white sky that was up there before. Uh, if you wanted sun rays, you can place the sun wherever you wanted it to be. If you, there you go, how about that? But if you're serious and you want to do things like portraits, for instance, if you click on face, all portrait in answer, you can lighten up the face so the face doesn't look as dark. That's perfect if you're married to a Thai lady, lighten up her face, you know, save her spending a fortune on lightning on the whitener you red eye remover obviously oh, you can't hardly see my eyes you can remove the dark circles you can make yourself have a slimmer face look watch you know you can enlarge the eyes it's all done on a slider you literally just can move it wherever you want. Very simply, very easily. You can improve your eyebrows. Uh, your lip your lip saturation. You can make your lips bright red, like you're wearing lipstick. You know, you, that one, there you go. So it looks like, I'm, like you're wearing lipstick. You can darken your lips. You can use teeth whitener. You can't do that with mine because I'm not showing up. But everything you want you can do do all the advanced stuff on here as well but it's all done on slider so if you're more advanced than me and you genuinely want to think you can actually you know it is you can go on to the pro settings and you've got all the the mid tones uh, the highlights the highlights you know the shadows you've got everything that you need you know with the, with, if you was a pro on this, I'm not, so I don't mess about with that. But, you know, I mean, just turning a picture from a normal picture into a better quality picture is brilliant with this. I mean, and then the last picture, you look at this, it looks quite boring. Sky replacement, I'd probably go down starry night, looks a little bit better. Yeah, you can have a, you can put a moon, so you can have a starry night and have a moon up there like that make it a little bit smaller does that look all right this is the uh the software it's the uh, sky loom uh, luma 4 it's it costs it's a one-off payment at the moment it's a one-off payment of 40 pounds you can use it as a add-on to others you know, like photoshop it, you can use it as an add-on for photoshop it stands on its own right as an individual thing as well so you know check it out see what you think this video is not sponsored by them it's just me showing you what software i use thank you take care